Welcome back. Yo guys, how's it going? It's the boy the Wash Pug, and today we're gonna be answering some questions. This is a little Q and A. I told you I'd be coming. No, no I wouldn't be coming. The video would be coming. Yeah. <laughs> So at number 10, if you could go back in time to meet your younger self and give it a bit of advice, what would you say and why? I'd, I'd say to myself, save up, right? Because then I'd be rich by now. I mean, I've spent thousands and thousands over the years, and if I was to save up most of that, I'd probably be rich. So I'd tell myself, you know, be wise with your money, save up, you little prick, otherwise you're going you're gonna to be a bum. I'm not a bum, but I will be. That makes sense. Live it young while you can because you grow up too fast. That's it? Yeah. That's it? Yeah, seriously. That's all I'd say. Live it young while you can. You sound like you're doing a rap there. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Number nine. What did you want to be when you was little? Um, I wanted to be big. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to be a teacher because I used to love writing and drawing and Teaching little kids, little kids, little kids, little kids. <laughs> you were definitely gonna be like, you're gonna be a pedo when you're older. That's just declared. <laughs> like, you, you decided when you was like, oh, everyone, yeah, I'm gonna be a pedo. No, I like, I like teaching my friends, like playing to each other, and I just wanted to teach them really bad. What's one food you cannot live without? Um, chocolate's not a food, is it? Yeah. It is? Yeah. Well, it's an edible, but it's not a food. It's still a food. I think food classes is a must. Pizza. I couldn't live without pizza. <laughs> I couldn't. I just couldn't live without pizza. It, it wrecked my life. I'd have to kill myself. If someone said to me, today, if you eat another pizza, you'll die. I would just eat that last pizza. At least I died loving something. Or enjoying something. Peas. <laughs> peas? Yeah, peas. Alright then, fair enough. <laughs> I don't know many people say that, but she can't remember that reads. So at number seven, we have Would you rather have the power to read minds or be invisible? Um, I, I wouldn't have the power to read minds. I'd have the power to be in, go turn invisible because reading minds would make me go absolutely mental knowing what people are thinking. And you'd be one of the most violent pricks ever. Because, you know, if someone hated you and they're like, yeah, like, well. I'm sitting in the corner over there, I wanna beat the fuck up. You'd know he's thinking that and you'd throttle him. Why? Yeah, but then at least like, you know and you can get in before he gets you. Yeah. Oh well, that's a good point, Ziggle. Let's go in for a fight. Well, he's like, I'm gonna swing with the left. You just you just duck the left, pop him, boom, dead. Or pull out a gun and just kill him. I'd rather have the power to read minds because I could know what them bitches are saying about me. I know there's a lot of itches that don't like me. Number six, how did you get your name? Right, this is just... Thanks, man. I really love you. Clearly you don't love me because I was named after an horse. <laughs> <laughs> My mother had a pet horse, right? And it was probably one of the most... I grew up with this horse. And it was the horriblest horse ever. It bit me. It went for me. It was the most horrible thing. But guess what? I was named after a grey fucking stallion. That's, that was my name. That's why I got named after an horse. Listen to it, it's fucking twat. I was named after a Greek princess. Uh, the Greek princess name is Sidera, but in English it's Sophia. So you get named I'm after a princess. a princess, and I'm a fucking horse. <laughs> it wasn't even a nice horse, either. it was a scabby, runty, fat fuck. So number four is, can you curl your tongue? Is it, what, like, how, how do you curl your tongue? Can you do it? Yeah. Uh, I shall count. <laughs> there you go. So number three is what is your family nickname? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. My name's Daisy. My nickname's Daisy. I've actually got a cat named Daisy. She's a little twat. Um, if you shout with her, she will legit piss on your thing. These fucking birds, look at them. 
But anyway, my name's Daisy. I got my name um, on a holiday trip. Basically, my DS buttons were broken. And on Mario Kart, I clicked Daisy the Princess. And because it happened three times in a row, they thought I was doing it on purpose. But I was genuine that my, my DS was broke, so that's how I got my name, Daisy. And it's stuck since I was about nine. Twinkles, because for some reason my nana just always called me Twinkles because I had little feet. And, yeah. You still have got little feet. What size are you? Tell what size you are. Tell them what size you are. Twos and threes. Twos and threes. No, <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> so at number three, we have what is your nervous habit? Now, my nervous habit is my leg bounces up and down. So like, I went for an interview, right, and I was being filmed, and I was sitting there, and both of my legs were going like this. And it was on TV as well, so my, my legs were going even more. <laughs> you know, no one in this camera staring me dead in the face, and I'm having an interview, my legs were going. They were going like crazy, but that is my nervous habit. I do it kind of quite naturally as well sometimes. Mine is picking my nails and biting my nails. I'm just like... Say it again, <laughs> say it again, like the camera. My nervous habit is biting my nails and picking my nails. It just happens. It just happens. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. It just kind of nervous, it just happens. It just does. Great, there's, there's, there's the room gone. Okay, even that the camera's gone dead. Yep. Okay. Okay guys, so my camera just died, so I have to charge you up. Um so at number nine we've got What was your first stuffed animal called? And why? No, what was it called? Yeah, what was it called? What was the name? What did you name your stuffed animal? It was a teddy bear. <laughs> and I named it Fluffy. Is that it? Yeah. Fuck. Mine is much cooler, right? You know, there's a program when I was a kid, it was out before I was born, but it's called Alfie. And um, it's about an avian. So that was my first ever teddy. And I actually named it after the character Alfie, because I used to watch that program like 10 times a day. And now I've actually named my pug Alfie. So that's where the pug comes from. That sort of comes from my YouTube name as well. So my pug, Alfie. And I'm Welsh. So at number one, we have what is your secret talent? Tea needing, I've done it quite a long time. I'm a and I really enjoyed it as well. Quite a long time. You've done it for four years, man. Four or five, yeah. Well, guys, my secret talent is. I don't do it anymore. So it's more like a past thing. But at the moment, I play guitar. Uh, but my secret talent was ballet. <laughs> I used to do ballet until I was about 10. Uh, I, I, would, what, I was a big fan of Billy Elliot. Um, and I just used to do ballet. I'm dead serious. I talk lessons and all sorts. I was a fairy. <laughs> I just asked Sophia to sing a little song with me. She said, I stay, she said. I'm not singing a song because you're a fucking stupid mom. I'm not singing a fucking song. Ah, I missed. So that's it for today's video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to drop your fat pug on that like button. If you didn't like the video, <laughs> if you didn't like this video, don't forget to smack that dislike button. But until next time.